Hey boys, what's up? Welcome back to another Paul Massive video, and today we're gonna go ahead and EX finally the Bugsy and Scyther that I've had at 2020 for a very, very long time. Uh, but now it finally has the opportunity to EX. Even though it didn't get an EX style. Despite the fact that the other two from the same event format got EX styles, which is slightly infuriating, but you know, whatever. <laughs> <laughs> well, there it is. The the EX for Bugsy and Scyther. Okay. Again, a lot of these units uh, got like EXs recently, right? And like everyone and their mom just got EXs. Just like a lot of like the BP units. It's basically all the four star BP units, uh, all the Lodge units, and the three Evolutions from the previous uh, variety scout, plus Scyther. <laughs> So Scyther's kind of just here on its own, its category, but you know what? Uh, we, 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 we have to do it, right? It's it's the, ch it ch it's the channel mascot. Um, well, one of them. And it's it's good unit. It's definitely a really, really, really nice unit. Uh, obviously, you know, being a support, having that support EX is always going to be good. And also, it's just, uh, again, you have a lot of things. Yeah, 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 you know, it has synchro healing, which is very, very, very nice in Gauntlet, which makes it a lot more runnable in Gauntlet. Not that it wasn't before, it's just that defensively it's not that great, right? Um, to, to really survive long enough in Gauntlet, but now, you know, you have that extra incentive to actually sync with them. With that synchro healing, that's definitely much, much better uh, in that case, but obviously it's just a... It's a physical support, right, that can max out your physical attack and, and, phys and crit, Right, while also giving you move gauge acceleration and debuffing the opponent's defenses. So that's just really, really nice, man. It's really, really nice. Um, and yeah, that's that's why it's a good unit. That's why it's I do think it's definitely worth EXing, even though it doesn't have that EX style, which again, unfortunate, but you know. <laughs> the unit is good at least. The unit's good at least. Also, you might notice from the uh, the, the overlay and all that stuff uh, on the video that I am in the middle of recording uh, my gauntlet streak, so uh, I will shamelessly also plug this into my um, gauntlet run video when it's done. So, I don't know, save me some time, because look man, recording gauntlet streaks, if there's one thing <laughs> that it uh, it costs a lot of, it is um, time. A lot of time. I think I'm in my, like, what, sixth hour now, and I'm like only like a quarter of my way done, so. Anyways, uh, yeah. So don't don't uh, don't don't blame me too much when you see this <laughs> this part show up in the uh, Gala video a few days later. <laughs> all, right, all right, let's go, let's go. Versus uh, Tapu Bulu here, and we're gonna have uh, Scyther obviously um, be at the tank over here, uh, be here to buff all that stuff. Mallow's here to do damage. Uh, surprise. And uh, I don't know. I just brought like a support random like. Weedle Eggmon, just cause. Okay. Uh, <laughs> let's see. We get, uh, let's get a few trap kicks in to start. And post haste, very nice. I don't even know. Like, how, how long is this Weedle gonna survive, folks? How, how, how long do you think it's gonna it's, it's, it's gonna be here for? <laughs> okay. Um, poor thing. Anyways. Hmm. Should we? Leave it to yeah, me. let's let's sync with Scyther right away. I feel for multiple reasons, right? Multiple reasons. First of all, you know, support EX, but also we get the uh, synchro healing. And Ready. look, is that gonna end of the day? Is that gonna save Weedle from its, in, uh, you know, the fate uh, that's coming very soon to it? Probably not, but. I don't know. I'm just, I'm, I'm just trying to be nice to this poor Weedle over here, which is, uh, was was not really built for this, unfortunately. Okay. There's a lot of things you could say about Top of Bulu, but yeah, yeah. But it, it could it could definitely it could definitely it could definitely hit hard, and it could at least take out like a you know one star egg mod. So. Uh, we, we we tried our best, folks. We tried our best. We um. Max out it. Well, not max out, but use as much uh, defense as we could over there, right? Help it out, and um, we try to debuff Bulu's uh, physical attack as well to help. But, 
yeah, some things are just uh, some things are just, just a bit tough, unfortunately. All right, let's get the uh, let's get that in. Evasion, first aid, heal. All right, not much to worry there with Scyther. Let's get a sink in with Mallow. All right, do some damage and. Maybe afterwards we'll uh, we'll go back to sinking with um, Scyther, right? Just again, just for the heals, right? You can do it. Okay. Uh. Ouch. Not really. At, at least we didn't get the. Uh, at least we didn't get um flinched. Cause you know that would have been annoying. Although I I think we still haven't triggered our first uh or first our only quick cure yet. So it wouldn't have been like that bad, but. I still would have preferred not to get uh, flinch just in case, right? Might throw us another flinch. But what if we get flinch later on? Oh. Okay, so this one's gonna be tough, right? Are we gonna survive this grassy terrain boosted seed bomb? The answer is yes, apparently. <laughs> Which, honestly, I'm not gonna lie, I'm slightly surprised by. Because again, uh, I love Scyther and all, but I'm gonna be real, it is not the best. <laughs> not the best, uh, not the best tank, right? But. It did get some help, did get some help with this, uh, with a lot of this stuff, right? Including, again, Synchro Healing over here, right? Yeah, you don't, you don't see the Sync move animation too often either. <laughs> there it is. Boom. Everyone gets healed a bit. Uh... Even though it proved me wrong last time, I, I, I would love for it to prove me wrong here again, but I don't, I don't think it's Woodhammer, man. It's Woodhammer. <laughs> I don't think. Also, uh, buffed its uh, you know, attack back a bit. So, well, it did its job. It did its job. It maxed out uh, our our main damage dealer's stats, and yeah, um, it uh, it debuffed the opponent's physical defense to to minus six, and yeah, it definitely definitely left its mark. I'd say. On, on the battlefield before it unfortunately went down, but it's all right. It uh, it helped us enough for our um, Mallow to to finish the job here. Also, thankfully the draft parent went away there, but <laughs> yeah. All right, all right. There we go. I think that was like streak streak twenty seven, right? Yeah. Well, voila, voila. <laughs> I got I got two done in one. <laughs> so yeah, uh, again, this uh, the scythe is really really nice. I I, I definitely do recommend uh, going for it. Right again, there's there's a few other good ones as well. I uh, I did a video recently going over some other really really nice ones that you know you could probably consider EXing as well. And uh, I do think scythe is one of them. But you know, there's all the large blue that's really nice. There's the uh, Lieutenant Surge, right? BP, that's cool. Um, the evolutions are definitely really, really good to EX as well. So, a lot of, lot of options, right? Don't have to go for Scyther, but uh, I would recommend it. <laughs> I would recommend it. <laughs> um, but yeah, anyways, yeah, that's me in this one. Hope you all enjoyed my guys. Think in the comments down below. Like and enjoy the videos for my channel for some more Pokemon content. And I'll see you guys in the next one then.